But anyways, we have, you know, an RNG item manipulator thing. It's pretty cool. So right now we're looking for spike and spike balls or grinder. That's the choices here. And that's what we're doing, basically. Also, this is expert no skip, if you didn't <laughs> if you were wondering what we're playing. I'm just testing my internet because I don't trust it with Super Expert right now. And it's not for this level, so you're gonna <laughs> see it would have been great if it was for this level. It would have been amazing. But you see, it's not for this level. Did I look at the No I didn't. Okay, two minutes. All right, let's see. What do we have here? Why would I ever do that to myself? I don't know. Oh, kind of funny, actually. I shouldn't have died there, but I'm a little rusty. Yeah, you would have lost big, but it's okay now. Make sure you predict. It's to the top of the chat, or if you click on the channel point icon, you can predict your points there. Can I just... You don't think. Well, at least they give me a chance to go back. I like that. I thought I could cheese it. Let's be honest here. It was really tempting. I think the level character didn't know you could sneak that mushroom out, but I'm not entirely sure. Can I just go in these? No? Oh. Uh, okay. All that for a one-up, nice, okay. Yeah, Perdition does not still count for this level. It's the next level. We're looking for a saw, or a green spike, or a spike ball. That's all we're looking for. I deserve that. I, I knew it was there, and yeah, I still took damage anyways. Whatever. Maybe Yoshi, it's okay. Gotta add a little spice to the predictions, you know. Completely random, we have no idea what's gonna show up. And there will be specifications, like... A key cannot be a red coin key, apparently. I've seen that one before. Oh, okay. Unseen contraption, yes. That's how I like my Marmaker, too. You know, I wish they wouldn't use yellow pies for everything. It'd be nice. This level seems kind of long for two minutes, you know. Really? You're gonna put me at the very beginning of the level? Alright. I made this a little bit easier, but no, you had to make it difficult. Now we can also do this. Well, it doesn't matter now. But for a speedrunning situation, it could have worked out really well. I was faster. I did it to my... That's the whole troll of the level. Okay, I get it now. <laughs> I understand why that door is there and why it's so easy to go back into it. It's a never-ending loop. Nice level design. You know, level creator, I gotta say, if you're gonna make something like this, don't put the door so far away, yeah? That'd be great. And again, maybe they wanted, you know, get player that, you know, that one-up. Maybe go exploring. Maybe that's their intention. I don't know. But I gotta go down here now before I forget. Otherwise, I'm gonna keep going on a loop forever. And that wouldn't be fun. Still not a bad level, though. I don't mind it. Double pipe? What? Yeah, I'm not going up there. I'm 
glad I didn't go up there. It wasn't a soft one, but it was very close to being one. And this level in. Oh, okay. There it is. Man, this would have been a great level for their prediction. Alright, this level went onward. Green spike, spike balls versus saws or grinders. Well, I already know who's winning. What an amazing turn of events! Literally with an eye's view. In multiple places. It's literally a new soup styled speed run for the most part. Cool. Probably shouldn't have wasted that. But too late now. I could go on the top. Hmm, probably should have done that. Okay. Probably in here, right? Cool. Look at that. Can I get a P-switch? Ain't no piece, but she's gonna get it. There ya go. Good job, Mobile Creator. Finally gave me what I needed. Well, that was fast, right? Yeah, I'm a winner. Alright, time for a new prediction. Here we go. Super Mushroom versus Shoot Goomba. Only Super Mushroom. Nothing else. Alright, same thing. Super Mush versus Shoomba. Shoot Goomba. These people don't know. Not for this level, obviously. And don't worry about spelling. I've never been a fan of Grammar Police, honestly, all that much. But if you get into a heated argument, it tends to be that kind of way. Remember, this level does not count for the prediction. Wow. You know, it's really weird, alright? The first level we had, it they had spikes everywhere that it had saws. If this has Shumba's next level, I will be surprised. Literally super mushroom off the bat. I mean, I guess it's not really that surprising because... But it's not in the block, so that's even... I don't know. It's really hard to say if that's surprising or not. There's multiple of them. Cool. Is this really a shell jump? No. I guess it's expert. Not too... Not too impossible to happen. You're gonna duel me? Hold on, Silver. I don't know how else I use that function. Oh, it's a time limit. Got it. If it's really the same thing over and over and over again, it's there is no challenge. Wow. Oh. Hello, Rob Wool. Rob Wool. Very interesting name. I think J's are hard for me to pronounce. I feel like. A weird level. The next level will count because the prediction timer is about to run out. Remember, it's mushroom, sorry, super mushroom versus Shumba. And it's not for just for the next level, it's until we see it, so. Alright, let me see if I can duel. Like that? Is that how you do it? Cool. Congrats on your rupees. All five coins, okay. I don't know why you're thanking me. <laughs> He's all RNG. Doesn't look very fun, honestly. But an expert, it makes sense. In 
those Pota boots are pretty scary. Random big old jump out of nowhere, okay. Interesting level design. Oh, now I have to just wait. A bumper, huh? That's how we're ending it? Interesting. A boss fight at the end. No, that's just the whole bubble. Um, yeah, you're right. The Shumba can only appear in SMB1 and SMB3. But wait, SMW has Shumbas, don't they? Oh, they have dry bone shells, never mind. I always forget that uh, SMW doesn't have the same content, even though they're the same pixel graphics. I'm always thinking, how can I jump out of a thing? Oh, duh. Oh, what? This. Pick a path literally at the start. Cool. Nice. Great design. Amazing. All right. So right side was apparently correct. I think left is also a trap. Well. I'll go in the pipe, sure. And then I'll send it next time. Dead. Holding right was okay. There might be something over there. Uh. Okay. I'm surprised I didn't die to that piranha. Wait, what? That's it? Okay, I, I guess that's just the blessing, really. I didn't see no super mushroom though. I feel like that level had a lot more to it for pick a path, but we just kind of cheesed it. I don't see no mushroom yet, but there might be a mushroom in this level. Speed puzzles, though. Ugh. Not the greatest thing in the world. Okay, what am I doing here? Am I shell jumping? N no. Yeah, maybe? This is probably to activate the... Not. Uh, we need to hit the on-off switch with the E-switch, but... We all I think we need to... Why is there an arrow up here? What am I doing? Does it activate him, really? Hmm. How do I activate that thwomp? I can't go into the bumper. I can't shoot the shell. It just, it would be bad. I don't see no on-off that I can hit. I could shell jump up there, but I think that's not what they wanted. Why is there a shell mitt if I can't do anything immediately at the start? It's a very interesting... Level. If I go up there, though, I'm stuck. But the conveyors go to the right. It's almost as if I need a bomb. Can't go in there. Hmm. Why would I want the shaman up there? There's no reason. And I feel like going up there myself is just gonna get me soft locked. But I mean. Oh, I'm sorry, just an invisible block that was just chilling there and I had no idea. Thanks, good puzzle, right? Not even marked. Okay. Amazing. I was wondering what the hell was going on here. Okay. I need to go in there. I don't know what that's for, but I'm just gonna take damage. Nothing in there. Okay, I wasn't gonna win anyways. The Yoshi... Podaboo. Yoshi and Podaboo. Got it. How long is this level? Okay, I can grab a shelmet then and be fine. Oh, 
Oh, right. I probably should do this first. Oh, that's what this is for. That makes sense, I guess. It should be an up arrow instead. Whatever. This is just donut block waiting time. This, there's no puzzle here, really. And then we do this. We get in there. We hit this. Get our photo boot. Let's just grab it. Mr. Yosh. Don't eat the bomb. That would be bad. Hello, Oliver. Oh, man. I didn't see no mushroom still, right? Yeah, no Shumba. No mushroom and no Shumba still. This is interesting. I'm gonna vote for the speed... Uh, speed run puzzle shouldn't exist. But if you're gonna make a spear and puzzle, you have to mark your Kaizos no matter what. You have to mark it. That arrow is not good enough. Also, you can eat the bomb. There's no reset door in case you fuck up. Like, in a spear and puzzle, at least give the player a chance to redeem themselves, you know? If we're not gonna give them any fairness involved with the in invisible block. Well, this is fun. Four seconds. Japan. Run killer? Oh, it's a triple. Or not! I got lucky there. That was a very... Well, let's put it this way. You, if you didn't dodge that, you died. There were two ways to die there. You, if you didn't twirl right or you hit the spike. I'm moving on. Also, Fire Flower doesn't count. We're looking for a Super Mushroom. Yeah, there was a reclaim in the other level, the puzzle, but I felt like it was, there was no need to go for it. Honestly, you don't expect these kind of levels in Expert, but since the algorithm change... Really? Okay. Seems like a well-designed level. Didn't seem blind at all. Not a fan of holding shells and touching bowls, but I think it was a pretty good level. I'm really surprised we haven't seen a Super Mushroom level since that one level that was a free Super Mushroom like three times. A guy named Blue Pinkman definitely will give us a Super Mushroom, right? Like, they wouldn't just not give us a- here we go. There we go! That's what I like to see. Oh, just a blind jump, okay. Let me go ahead and just choose the outcome real quick. I actually do want that mushroom. Almost didn't make that jump. And blind jump here? Yeah, I don't know why. checkpoint placement. Isn't this a bonus section? I mean, I deserved that for going too fast, but I was big, so what could I do there? The ceiling spike was gonna get me if I didn't. This has gotta be a bonus path, not the real path, right? At least it feels like a bonus path, so. Can be a secret exit? Some level creators do that. Very little do, though. Wait, what? That was the whole- Are you telling me to the right there was just nothing but a wall? Okay. That pipe really did seem like a bonus area, honestly. Okay. Alright, 
here we go. Next random item. Superstar versus Cannon. That's a very interesting combo. This includes red cannons as well, by the way. Just so you know. Doesn't inc include Bill Blaster, which is just a boy launcher. That's all it is. And it doesn't count for this level. Hey, Barry, how you doing, man? Interesting coin placement, but okay. Understandable. I was gonna say, why well, don't. Why wouldn't I grab that? I could grab that 10 coin, but I don't really care for it. Oh my lord, what in the world is this? Did it oh, it's a fire fire. Okay, I have to use this to get my, you know, I, I guess? I've never seen a concept like this, but it exists apparently. I'm not gonna do this, probably like this. Seems like a waste of time, but okay. I know you can get on the next height there. It's possible, but it's just not fun. Somebody found this section or this level fun, by the way. I deserve that, but it's okay. I just wanted the coins anyways. Hello, hold on. Yeah, I probably don't want to do it like that. Normally that would probably be a soft block, but luckily I'm able to hit that. Oh my god, no! <laughs> no, I'm s is that a softy now? Or is, or is it Bowser Jr. that has the key? If Bowser Jr. has the key, then it's not a soft block. It's just not fun. I'm gonna just go for it. Okay, I'm on top. That's cool, I guess. I need... Oh, okay. Oh! oh, I didn't know he was... Okay, well, whatever. He's gonna come over here anyways. It doesn't matter. Wait, I need both of them. This level sucks. This level blows. I hate it. There has to be a hidden star, right? There's no way. Unless they like open. Oh no, they opened up the pathway when they came back down. Yeah, it's a real level. Yeah, that's just not cool. Man. Yeah, I saw the double door, but I was hoping it was fake. It's rare, but it does happen. Oh look, I'm back at the start. I guess it's unique. I guess it's one way of looking at it. But I wouldn't have locked the player in the first bit, you know. Let's keep this up. Roy Ru Wei. It just takes so long to get the first bits to come through. Oh, I could just do that. Okay, that works. Hold on. I'm gonna open this up a bit and hold on. I don't trust this at all. All my lives. Hey Flynn, how you doing, man? Thanks for the 24 months or two years. Appreciate that. Welcome back. Almost like I just saw you the other day. Okay, well, anyways, we have invented fire flowers so we can kill them. I think I'm gonna open this up a bit more.
have an idea. That works too. We can just deal with this guy first. So my plan is to get him down here, and then just insta-kill him. That was the idea. That's gonna be hard to do anyways. Or unless he just willingly comes here anyways. That still hits. That's, that's fair. Imagine I just fell there. Yeah, he just hit that. down here, which is good. This is what we want. Don't fall. Why is there even a pit there, honestly, in the first place? Let's keep this up. Thanks for seven months. Hey, no problem. Hold on. Playing a really garbage level right now. Please. Thank you. Jesus. What an annoying piece of crap, I tell you. Uh, Zachary, thank you for the seven months. Appreciate that. Welcome back. Oh, I did not mean to go back in there. I just didn't see the pipe, honestly. Interesting. Who's son made this and why are they grounded now? Exactly. The beginning was awful. Uh, you know, I can excuse it for out of a boo, but that's about it. And we still haven't seen... Yeah, we still haven't seen a cannon. A cannon or a superstar. Right? Yeah, we really haven't. I see one now, though. Hold on. What? Orphelius Why? 1 cheered with 200 bits. Okay. Really, seeing here 200 bits, do appreciate that. Yeah, make sure everyone drinks water. And take your meds. Don't forget about the necessities of your life, you know? Anyways, that being said, I didn't need- I didn't expect that fish to come get- Oh, are you serious? I'm dying to the same fish twice. Okay, this is classic. You know what? We're killing the fish first, because screw that. I'm not dealing with that garbage again. No, you're gonna come back and hit me. I know- I know how you work. You know what? Maybe I just wanted to farm three one-ups and lose two, you know? Hold Maybe on. that's where they really wanted. cheered with 100 bits for the train. For the train. Oh yeah, there is a train, huh? I appreciate that though. 100 bits. Thanks, Zach Rick. Superstar or cannon? That's a very interesting combo. I don't know if we're gonna see it though. At least not in this level. Like a very basic water level so far. Well, mostly water anyways, because there's still desert. Okay. Am I supposed to kill the sun? Is that the whole purpose here? I hope that's an okay thing to do. I bet you the whole layer is here, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. He's pointless, but okay. And I wish I had that spring now to be able to go fast here, but... Wait a minute. The level just turned from a normal, like, okay, whatever water level to... What is this garbage? Because now we got ourselves a different time period of the level creator's mind. For some reason, they just wanted a random speedrun section underwater? I don't really see those very often. No, oh, I take that back. It's not a speedrun section. You know what this is? It's a troll section. Okay. Otherwise, they wouldn't have that there. Springs, I mean. And the bumpers. It looked like a speedrun section at first, but then I realized it was just trolls, so... 
Wow, there's a lot of water sections, apparently. How come all the expert levels tend to be really long? I don't understand that. Maybe they're easier, but they're longer, so there's just no one wants to have it in Super Expert, I guess. But then again, you do see some long levels in Super Expert, but only because they have like a really hard technique at the beginning or at the end. Let's keep this up! 20 months in a row? Now that's pretty pog. It is pretty pog, I do appreciate that. Hold on. Oh! There's wind guys now, watch out. Changing up the level design here. Trying to make it harder for us to win if we're just holding right. <laughs> okay. Hey, Chess. It's been a while. Thanks for the 20 months, dude. Welcome back. Oh, look, at 50 over there. Don't really care. I don't know how I didn't take damage there, but we take those, yeah. Why? I feel like when people find the invisible block or the hidden block item on their wheel, they just abuse it. It's really bizarre. Yeah, it looked more like precision than troll, but the side the sideways springboards they're trolly, if that makes sense, Siemens. Alright, superstar or cannon? Come on, where are you at? There's not gonna be one in this level, I don't think. That was not meant to be a big jump, but I just realized it has to be a buffer jump. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That jump has to be a buffer jump or I die. You gave 10,000 treasure, and I give you 75,000 rupees in return. Now, that is a great deal. Oh, no. That w Unless there's an easy way to get any of that red coin, that has to be a buffer jump, right? How else are you supposed to get that coin without taking damage? Okay, I'm gonna look around. Ugh. Level could eat a lot of lives here. It was 75k? Okay. Oh, thank you, Flynn. So here's a fun fact. When there's two blocks of a jump under you, which is like, say, like right here, you can't dock jump in, in SMB3 or SMB1. You'll just hit the spikes anyway. That's why I'm like really afraid of this jump. Pretty sure it's a buffer jump from that cloud. Otherwise, I have no idea how to get that red coin. I'm not doing a jump for it. It is a buffer jump, but it's a smaller buffer jump. Unless I'm, like, making this harder than it needs to be. Hold on. I am making it harder than it needs to be. What? You can get that without... Hold on. Normally, if that was a spike ceiling, you would just die. Right? So why does that coin not kill me normally? If I'm on the edge of a cloud. Am I in a lower space? That's really bizarre. That is really bizarre. I didn't know that. So apparently if it's on a ceiling, you can just grab that coin. Huh. No, the, the coin hitbox is larger than the spike. That's not the point. The point is, if you were to jump in that situation, normally you would just die if you had a ceiling above you. It's because that one block was open is the reason why I was able to not die. It's because the corners of spikes apparently don't... Man? Huh. The corners of spikes apparently don't have a hitbox. Or if it, it's very small if there is one. I'll have to look into it after this run right here, or this level. Now I'm really curious about it. Wait. Oh. It probably is a diamond shape, but it's more like a hexagon. I'm pretty sure the spike hitbox is a hexagon now. What I just saw. What? Oh, okay. 
I had a feeling. I had a feeling they were gonna be mean and rude about it. But I really do think that the spike hitbox is now to hack hexagon and not a. Oh, that would have been useful last life. That would explain because Luigi slash Mario slash Toad slash Toadette's hitbox is probably bigger or big enough to where when the spikes are connected, you're gonna die anyways to the spike ceiling because your hitbox is too big to get between the hexagon. But if there's a, oh no. Like, can there only be three? What? Must be some sort of entity manipulation. Hey, there's a Shumba from earlier. Okay, there's gonna be an enemy in it, right? Yeah, okay. It's just... It's just a platform, that's all it is. This level shouldn't be an expert, by the way. This is super expert stuff. I wanna go get the 50 coin real quick. I almost feel like there's a troll here. I'm not sure. Should just be three, right? Yeah. Is this a troll as well? No, this is real. I'm pretty sure anyways. I can't go up there. Oh. Probably the way the mushrooms there. Oh, this seems like fun and very intuitive. I had to hit it multiple times. Fun! Twice. Okay, cool. Great design. For anyone that doesn't know, that's a piece of crap contraption because it's on wings. I feel like this level has a dev accident, but maybe not. I might check this level after we complete it in the viewer to see if there was a dev accident. Assuming that there isn't a forced dev accident to win that I have to find anyways. Maybe one of these pipes. I mean, it's not really hard to do. It's just time consuming to get to the spot every single time is all. because that one section just shouldn't even be in the level. But there's other things too that made the level kind of garbage, like the chain chomp of the pipe, that's really uncalled for. I don't know what this is about, but I'm sure there's a troll here I'm, keep, I'm like, I keep missing. And they use red pipes, they know what they're doing. It is terrible, old wolf. It's awful, there should not even be an expert. This is definitely a super expert-esque level, or at least back in the old algorithm days. Oh well, I guess I'll just die to a Shumba. I want to test the clear rate of this level. I want to look at it in viewer, because I'm curious. But not until I beat the level first. I have high suspicions for it. It could just be a real level and expert, but... It's rubbing me the wrong way because there's just so many open spots I could check for hidden stuff. Yeah, I went a little too early. Fair. It's gonna eat a few lives here. If not, like, 10 or 20. I keep dying in the same spot. I'll tell you one thing though, the level is boring. It's too big. There's some weight spots in the level. And some minor trolls. 
You're probably wondering, well, why don't you just run to the red pipe? No, you'll just die to a chain chomp before you get a chance to enter it. Red pipes are like that. We take those. I almost died. Oh my god, no. No, a one frame P switch jump. I have not warmed up today. Come on, man. <laughs> I think I could just skip that P first P switch now that I think about it. I just wasted the life. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I could just skip that too. Hold on. It's all the screen step stuff. I saw stuff up here, and I had no access to it. Really bizarre. Why would you have that like that? Okay. Checks out for now, but there's some stuff in the top right that is very interesting. Could be their thumbnail. It gets much better, yeah. I have to start using claw controls to even want to beat this level now. survive that, but okay. Pretty sure you could just skip this one. Yeah, you can. And then there's a pipe down there, I see it. I gotta press jump early. I don't got my buffer game on. Not today, anyway. Yeah, we're looking for a cannon, not a blaster. Uh, build blaster is a separate item. So far, we haven't seen- oh, there could be a dev star in this level. That would be cool to find. But we haven't seen a star or a cannon yet. I'm very surprised. This level should have one, I think. But... <laughs> he keeps pushing me back, and I'm trying to get one of those times where it just goes to the left. It still screams dead items. It really does. Maybe that's why the spring is here? Now I missed that block by like one spacing. I'm gonna be very sad. Oh no, I, I'm gonna check in if you ever, anyways. You don't need to say anything, Simus. It's not right now. Dude, I'm just gonna keep missing it, apparently. There are definitely- there's something fishy about this level. I want to check these pipes, man. But, like, I don't want to waste a life on the pipes. Because I know I can do the P-Switch trick. It's not too difficult. It just takes a bit of a warm-up. I mean, I guess it technically is a one-frame trick, but there's a buffer jump involved with it, so it's a four-frame trick. Or maybe three still in the end, I'm not sure. It's a buffer jump, even though it's three frames is how long a buffer jump can last when you press jump. You buffer a jump. Does that include the one frame as well, timing, or...? I did it again. Hmm. something in the top right. You know this is here. Hmm. Looking for a clown car or a cloud. 
There's something in that top right over there. I saw it. Very suspicious. You think it's two frames? I thought it was three frames for a buffer. Huh. Okay. I know there's something here. Why is there an on- hold on. There's something here. There's something everywhere. This level... I don't know. Why would you build it like that? It feels like there's a block there, but I could be wrong. something in this level like there was a gap up there there was a top right in the first beginning area i know i missed something i just don't know where it's at oh don't tell me it uses the goomba hold on if it really is just a goomba jump that's so Big jump here? No? Oh. There's something in this level, I swear. There's something. It's just so suspicious. I am going mad. This level isn't real. It just doesn't feel real. There's something up there and I see it. I don't know how to reach it. Unless it's like a hidden cloud somewhere. It's just like right here. in the red pipe now at this point if it's not a hidden block it still just doesn't seem real why would it be an expert global record two minutes something down there probably just death down there though oh my god i died anyways i'm dying for no reason this no hints, no hints, no spoilers. That's why I have that in my tags now. You can't spoil the level for me if you have level viewer. Don't do it. The only time I'll ever use level viewer is when I'm like 100% sure that there's a hidden item. I'll use it in expert no skip. But I'm not 100% sure. I'm like 90%. And until I'm like absolutely sure I need a hidden thing to progress, I'm not gonna look at it either. And as far as I can tell, there's something hidden required yet. Oh. I'm gonna play the level now. As much as I hate it. Ah, and it pushed me to the right so I died. Fun. Mmm. Yeah, I really don't think they did the wing block thing and then all the P-Switch jumps. It just means they didn't do any of the level at all. That was intended, you know? That's why I'm so suspicious about it. It just feels like, yeah, like you get infinite tries, but are you gonna waste that much time to do one stupid trick, or did you have a lineup, you know? No, not really. You're not gonna waste any time on it. Why would you do that? There's no reason to waste time. There's a lot of dev items, or there's only one dev exit. Why am I wasting my lives? I'm not doing super expert. What? I'm doing expert no skip. Read the title, yeah? This, I know it's a super expert level, it's bizarre. I didn't check this yet, no? I really want to check those pipes. I feel like the pipe is the answer for some reason. Oh, I should have held left. It just seems so hard to do. It's three jumps, usually. Oh, 
Is it gonna be a Goomba Hop? That would be so dumb. I know, imagine reading, I get it. Did I check all of these yet? I don't think I did. Definitely doesn't seem like a real level though, that's for sure. I deserve that. That's my fault. I'm just losing lives at this point. I mean, if this was super expert, I would have skipped this long ago. But since it's expert, no skip, I have to play it. And I almost kind of would rather play the actual level than to try to find the dev exit, you know? Which I think is right above me. I haven't found it yet. Unfortunate. Could be a rip run if I don't, you know, get my D-Rest on and play the level properly. But I know there's something in here. Like, I've played so many levels, I know when there's something hidden. Or they're really making it deceptive to make it look like there's something hidden. There's actually nothing different about the level. Which is why I'm going to play the level instead. When I know I shouldn't. Come on. The level gets really crazy before that P-Switch storm. That is why I think there's something hidden. That's why I really want to find it really bad. And I, I know it's not above this one up because I tried and I checked it. Probably gonna be something really stupid too that I just missed barely. Knowing my luck. And it probably uses the speed from this, right? What I would have done. And even so, you'd have to use the, the Goomba to, you know, get that height anyways. To get onto that block if there was one hidden. Whatever. Probably just a real level, honestly. And I'm looking at nothing. There can't be anything down there. I mean, I guess there could be a hidden pipe down right, but... It's unlikely. This level does seem kind of familiar, yeah, in a way. All right, I'm gonna go check the pipe. It's the first one on the left. I don't think it's that one unless I missed it. I could have missed it. Could be in the Potaboo pipe. I don't think you can get on top of that vine area, but it might be possible if you do a really good jump, you know? Like I said, I'm just gonna start playing the level. I'm done looking around. I did my piece. And that one pipe, I could have missed it, but... I'm not gonna bother with it anymore. I'm just gonna play the level. I'm just gonna play it. I'd rather re waste my lives on the actual fake difficulty than trying to find this dumb dev accident. Really? I know I missed a requirement somewhere. And it probably uses the Goomba to find it, and it's so dumb. I bet you it's the Goomba. That's what I would have done, to make the player waste so many lives trying to find it. Or it's right here, and I completely missed it somehow. Or it's down there, and I can't see what's down there, but... There'd be a pipe down there. If you do a really good jump, you can get on top of this part up here. That's the answer, that's dumb. Whoa, that pushed me to the right, I was not ready for that. Yeah, that's, that spring jump is the reason why I'm looking for a dev exit, because I haven't seen anything yet. I mean, I guess I could do this every single life. It doesn't hurt to check every single block every time I die, so I'll just do that. It doesn't hurt to check. And that's why I'm gonna do it. I'll check every single block every time I die. That is 
the only way I could probably get out of the situation if there's something hidden there. I feel like there's something up there too, but I don't know. I haven't seen it yet. Maybe something here. I haven't really checked this room yet. This room has really been untouched by me. Probably nothing. Oh, I can check infinitely. You're right. It's just a dump. It's not a clear condition. I can check infinitely. What am I doing? It's fair. Maybe to the left from here. Okay, I'm gonna just do the one frame jumps, I think, and call it a day. I think I have a good strategy getting through that divine section each time I do it. I'm gonna ignore everything else. I think I can just beat the level if it's real. But I still think this is a dev exit. That spring with wings section, I think I found a way to make it optimized, finally. I'll, I'll eyeball in it, basically. Hopefully. I don't know if it's gonna work, but we'll see. You love it so much right now? It's probably something super easy to get and I just missed it. But there's nothing here. It could just be nothing here. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So then we hold right and then hold left when, when the spring goes that way. This level is proof the algorithm is broken. I shouldn't have died too many times in this level, but it does require super expert ability for sure. I haven't really had the time to play Peace Switch Land, so... I don't think it's down there. It could be a hidden Peace Switch as well. I think one of my lives, I'm gonna go to the left instead from that room. Just to see if there's just a dev exit. I'm actually really curious. But then again, that kind of ruins the whole point of looking for an invisible item. Then put it nearby. It must be really hard to hit, or I just barely missed it. This is really confusing. I don't know why this is here. Is it on a timer? If I hit the on-off, I can't come back through here, so there's no point. Yeah, because the semi-solids basically removes that function from Nintendo knows? Yeah, probably. Just look, you can't make it up there. Impossible. I think I can get it every single time doing that. I'm gonna waste a life and go to the left here. Okay, I had to know. Oh, okay, I know where I'm at. This is where the P-Switch section is at. Okay. I know where I'm at, at least. That's good. Don't really want to do a one-frame jump, but here we go. Or two frames of buffers, I guess. I used to be really good at them. Whenever Silver and Pinky used to make me play their piece for levels. Mostly Pinky, though. So I have to time that. Also, I see where the pipe is at. I have to time that jump with the other jump. This is this is not a real level. This level went from 1 to 100 so quickly. I don't mind if it kills my run. I really don't. Because we're such a low count in computers, it doesn't matter to me. I can make that jump. I just gotta... Realize that I have to do it on a different time frame out of the door. I don't think you can go right away. Might be able to. Look. Okay, 
50. I can make this pretty consistent now. Okay. I, the suspense is killing me. I didn't even know if there's anything to have in this. What in the fuck? This ending is so bad. This ending is really bad. I could just jump down there, I guess. This is not a real level. This is not real. <laughs> you know what? Fuck it. We're gonna keep checking all the Goombas stuff. Because I feel like this is why the Goomba's here. This is not a real level. This Goomba killed me, I swear. That end is so dumb. It's a perfect jump over the saw blades, basically. I jumped too late. Hey, Serge, we found a fake level in Expert No Skip. I'm pretty sure it's fake anyways. Let's see, we did four, so five now. Feels like there's a cloud car or something here. I mean, I don't know. It's really hard to say. I could have just missed it, honestly. Whatever. I'm too impatient to go find it because it's just a waste of time. If it was like, if I had over a thousand clears on this, you know, this run right now, I probably would go the extra mile and trying to find this dumb dev exit. But I know I could beat this level unless that saw blade jump is impossible, but I don't think it is. I found a consistent way of doing this, so it's not too bad, I guess. I mean, it's not too bad. Dreamer doesn't know. Oh, boy. Okay, I went a little too late there. When it starts going down, that's when I want to do it. There is no CP, as far as I can tell. That should be the end. Unless... Alright, I'm gonna keep track if I'm in the main world or subworld, actually. There might be just a hidden goal here. It takes two minutes long, so... If there is a fake goal, someone would have gotten a speedrun on this level. Yeah, there's no way it's down there. Yeah. And now we're in the subworld. So one of those pipes could be real. See in the sub world. I think I can just go under. There's an opening. It's really small. Right there. Okay, we need more speed. Oh, there's a door! There's a door in this level, okay. The door at the end, nice. Oh, am I dropping frames? Yeah, I yeah. am. Good thing I'm recording, though. This level's uh, amazing for content. I swear there's something here. But I also swear I feel like I tried everything. Anything that was natural, anyways. Can't go in those pipes unless you have, like, a big sp speed jump into that pipe up there. That, that is possible. Yeah, no, it's not just you. I drop frames all the time. It's my shitty $100 internet, you know? Yeah, this jump is possible. I just gotta get good speed. Yeah, okay. Alright, did I beat the level? Is it good enough? We good? Or is it gonna kill me? 
Uh huh. Yeah, I feel like there's a door up there. Or a mushroom. I mean, does the cloud jump isn't too hard. I can do it. I, I know I can. It's just, it sucks. Alright, so from this corner, basically I have to be like... It's been a while since I've done the cloud one. It could be this, or it could be one to the right. I don't really remember. I'll just double check. Sure, I'm lined up. Yeah, I made it. Okay, so where's the exit? The secret amazing exit to this level, I need to know. Any level here right now, by the way. Grabbing it right now. And yes, it definitely deserved its boo. We need to check this out. This level seems way too fake. It could just be a real level and expert. Highly possible, but it had so many extra things in the level. I don't believe it. It's gonna be such a dumb spot. Alright, let me double check. Is there something hidden up there? There is something up there. Th Whoa, what is this? Where does that door go? Does that just kill you? Is that a death trap? I'm actually really curious. Apparently that's what you're supposed to do, but... It might just be a real level. It could have some fake stuff in it. Could have a clown car in it. Heck if I know. I'm loading this level in. I have to know, though. Let me see. There is... Okay, so... Huh. This is really bizarre. What? There is just a single coin in the level. What? And it, you can't even access it. Is this just a real level and it's just dumb? It seems to be like a real level, guys. Hold on. I'm just looking through it right now. Well, those pipes are not accessible. This is all real, as far as I can tell. I, I don't know why there's... Huh. So you know where that 50 coin was? And you see that thumbnail right there? The 50 coin is below that thumbnail. And those question mark blocks have one-ups in them, but they have a Goomba that kills you right there. But to get to that door, oddly enough, it's impossible. You remember those red dotted line blocks we saw above that one springboard I was really curious about? That's where the key door is at, but there's no way to get there. It is completely impossible. And then they have a room with a single coin in it, and I don't know why. Remember that one way we saw on the top right of that chain shot pipe? It, it meant nothing. There was nothing there. The entire level was real, but it also was fake at the same time. Their level creation was what made it fake, but it was a real level. Wow, okay. I had a feeling it was a real level just with fake stuff. It was definitely a real level, though. I can confirm. There was no other way to beat the level. And there was no hidden, like, mushrooms or- What the hell? At least one muncher? How do I... Uh... Oh, there's a pow there. What? Okay, one to zero immediately. Huh. Okay, there has to be a hidden... Oh, it's not even hidden. It's just a real pow. What? What a bizarre level. I wasn't really psyching myself out, CMS. The only reason why it may seem like that is because you mentioned there was something. Suddenly. But there wasn't anything at all. You said you had the answers, but there was none at all. Yeah, see, Mr. your comments is what made me think there actually was deaf stuff. What you should have said is, I have the answers if there are any. Would have been more... Well, would have been less biased for sure. One side. We're still looking for Superstar and Cannon, right? Because here's our freaking Cannon right there. Well, you gotta be more vague. You made it sound like there was deaf stuff. Not just to me. 
any other streamer, you gotta be more vague towards if you're gonna try to hide the fact of anything in a level. Because with this level viewer out, anyone has the answers. And anyone can just tell you, honestly. And I prefer that nobody told me anything in level viewer. Is it really a... Wow. No hidden block. Oh. Is it all? This is not really good level design, then. Ah, yeah, it's a parachute swamp, but not marked. Okay, good to know. I could have made lives there. I wonder how I can... Oh, well, that's not gonna help. This you, this you, I don't want them to shoot at the same time. Spot. I'm gonna do this though, I gotta get some lives. Alright, this ain't gonna work. I'm just gonna use the staircase. And there goes my staircase. Goodbye. I guess I'm not farming then. Watch, there's gonna be like three lives at the end of this level. Oh my god. Never mind. I'm just gonna get out of here. Yeah, you gotta be like more vague. Less bias, you know. There was only one hidden block in that level. For a coin, I believe. And that's okay, I guess. I mean, it's not okay because you can shell jump up there, but... Not everyone gets this is gonna take the invisible block route, you know. Oh, we didn't do the cannonball. Let me go ahead and do that right now, real quick. Uh, this level seems like really garbage, but it's... Give me one moment. Choose outcome. Cannon. And the parentheses just meant up, you know, red cannons as well. It wasn't just... Oh. I didn't really have to do this twice. Okay. Such a lame requirement. Okay. I really dislike your pipe speed runs. They suck. They're not fun at all. I'm gonna go now. I see no reason not to. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> As if I'm supposed to just account for that. Great. Good job, Japan. Almost died there as well. Auto scroll speedruns shouldn't even be a thing. Well, in Kaisers I could see it being okay. And the speedruns like this? A bit more. So I'm supposed to just. I'm the drop? That? Oh, I'm supposed to go on this one. I almost messed that up. 
five? Five seconds? What? Ugh. Oh. Oh. Alright, let me go ahead and get the next one ready here real quick. As soon as the level starts, I'm just going to pause and pull it up. It's not a big deal. Same. Anyways, let's go ahead and randomize some items here for our next prediction. We got Goomba and Palboa. Uh, by the way, the Goomba accounts for every single type of Goomba out there. So all kinds. Goombrats, Goombas, and Goombas as well. Versus just Palboa. And it does not include the Pow Hat, apparently. That's what we're doing for this. Wait, is this a don't... Wait, what? I thought this was not a grab a coin level when it did that. It's a naked pipe. It can't be good. Okay. Yeah, Shumbas and Goomba masks don't count. It's just the regular, good old-fashioned Goomba and Goombrat variations. That's all it is. Like this one, for example. Is this a reset door? Wait, if this is just a reset door... Okay. I could go for the staircase strat. I'm just gonna wait. There's no reason to go for it if I don't have to. And we're safe. Cool. Tradition does not count for this level. Hey, anyway, there's our superstar we were looking for. Uh, okay. That's not a reset if you just use up all the stars anyways. Sorry. Uh, we haven't gotten the key yet, so we probably don't want- Ooh, hello. Perfect, I got my one-ups anyways. It didn't matter what I did there. level, right? No, people in Really? Okay. Oh, there's our red coins we're looking for. Okay. And these expert levels just add so much extra flavor. Flavor being just more level, really. Reality. I grabbed the 10 coin because it was going to reset my coins. So. And I died for that. Cool. <sighs> Amazing. Too much speed on the people and got me killed. My fault. I was a little blind though at the same time, like not necessarily fully my fault, but mostly my fault. It deserves a boo. It's just a really ugly level that's just probably too long. Too long in the sense it has too many different variables in the level. They used too many different items, I would say. Didn't keep really much any theme at all. And also kind of ugly. That doesn't make it a bad level, it just makes it an uncategorized level, basically. Just not the greatest level out there, you know? Imagine that like, he just bonked off and this was a trap the entire time. I could see that. Okay. You're not taking away my people, I'm sorry. 
to. Absolutely have to. You know, there was no reason to take away the people in there. I guess to just have a moment with the fuzzy, but whatever. Yeah, maybe there should have been a checkpoint at the people, and I agree with that. That would have been a really good change. Alright, we're looking for any Goomba variety except for Shumba and the Goomba mask. Versus the POW block, not the hat. Speaking of potential POW hats here that won't count. Oh, well, we found our Goomba. That was correct. Oh, I thought I was supposed to jump there for a second. I didn't tell me to jump yet. Well, I gotta get out of this, apparently. I'm gonna have to trust it because I have eight seconds left. If you're still supposed to have the car, I disagree. It says easy drive jungle, yet the car has to be dropped out there, so the only thing we could do is find another way around the level or something. But I don't see another car. Or did I miss it? Because you can't take the car there. It's impossible, see? You can't go over either. So this level was supposed to have more, you know, cars, but it doesn't. It's a fake level. It was like half made, I feel like. I'm gonna go down here. Take me to the end, yeah? Oh my... What? This level isn't real. It doesn't... It just doesn't feel like a real level. I don't know where the other car is. At all. Even then, the, the car doesn't help me here, either. You can't go over, see? It's impossible. So I'm just wasting my time with the car being there at all. Am I supposed to go down? <laughs> okay. I have no idea what I'm doing here, other than I have to just go fast, I guess. This box might be just be a waste of time. I don't think there's anything to do with it. Oh, I get it. It's an auto run now. That makes more sense. So this is a hold right, hold jump. Hold. Yeah, just whatever. Yeah, that was the end. Okay. They call it an easy drive jungle, yet they didn't allow the car to go through that, you know, one gap. It needs to be a two gap there. It was half car, half auto run with Mario. That was very garbage for a car level. Anyways, we have Goomba, so let's just go ahead and mark that down. Apparently I spin this- oh, uh, spin this. I, I played this level, apparently. Interesting. But it doesn't really matter. We're gonna go ahead and bring up the list here and just get a new one going. Pipe versus Buzzy Beetle. Interesting. Okay. So it includes pipes of all colors and glass pipes. Does not include ground blocks from SMB3. Oh, so the pipe theme, the forest theme. Got it. So, I gotcha, I gotcha. So we do pipe, all colors... Uh, glass as well versus Buzzy Beetle. What a really interesting, uh, I don't know. This, this is just a really interesting prediction. I feel like Buzzy's gonna win, but at the same time, pipes are so common too, so you know. Oh, wait, I, I know this level. This wasn't super expert. I remember this level. I got it like about a month ago. Oh, I don't remember that part, though. That part does not come to mind. But then again, maybe that's why I didn't like it. It was the troll out of the door.
guess it's not really a troll, but it kind of feels like one. No, this is definitely super expert level. I do remember this now. I do think that conveyor on top is really good design, though. I think I think I also mentioned that last time as well. I guess Super Expert is the new expert. Or rather, Expert's the new Super Expert, I should say, in that order. Alright, so the prediction will count for the next level coming up here. Hey, Risen, how's, how you doing, man? We're just doing some gambling. Uh, that was apparently clear 69. Nice. And I have a word from Zero that there is a new version of this. But it looks like I have to do some things to get it to work, so I'm probably gonna do it later. What in the world is this? Just so much sound effects on my screen. Oh, okay. Did we see a pipe? No. Did we see a buzzy beetle? No, they were spiny beetles. Or spinies. Okay, it looks like he has some audio for the thing now, but it's gonna be... It's gonna take some... jury rigging to get it to work, so... I won't mess with it until another time. Hey look, a pipe! <laughs> And look, that's the whole level. Oh, that's fine, Reason. Don't worry about it. Now we have Brick Block versus Warp Door. Does not include Warp Box, so it's just Door, basically. Gotcha. That's simple enough. Brick block. It includes P switch blocks too. So keep that in mind. When when a coin turns into a brick block, it counts. And we'll just do door. There you go. Hey, to go. Brick block also means turn block, by the way. Uh, turn blocks. Any block that can put a coin in it and hit it multiple times. That is the block we're looking for, just so you know. Except for a question mark block. It has to be like a regular brick block or turn block. That's the only two options you can have there. Isn't this level supposed to be called impossible? I have a feeling the end is gonna be really bad. It's just a weird feeling, you know? already so much. This should be in Super Expert if there's more than just this. On it. Oh, that's the whole level. Okay. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Let's just add an extra obstacle at the end, you know?
All right, so brick block and turn block. He switched the uh, coins that turn into brick blocks and turn blocks also count is now considered versus the other one. Which was door. Door versus brick block, basically. We haven't seen a brick block on screen, but there's more than likely a chance that question mark block next to it probably is a brick block. I know. Hey. No. That surprises me a little bit, gotta say. Still no brick blocks. These are P-switch blocks though, so they don't count for the prediction. Uh... Okay. I think being small is a necessity until that point, yeah. That's my fault. Although I think maybe that's why there's a... Maybe that's why there's a box. I don't know. I can buy it now. Well, there goes that idea. I'm gonna take damage uh, once. Do that. Come back over. Mm, I need to be small. Or at least I would rather be small here. Oh, that's not gonna help. Thank you. That's what I wanted. Get that after we hit the beast. That's all I really wanted it for for safety factors. Oh, look, a car. That's not a good sign. Especially when you go the other way entirely. This is going to be a very interesting one. But all right, still no brick block as far as I can see, but might be one soon. We'll see. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, there's a door right there. You're right, door wins. Okay, got him nice and time. Wow, you know, brick block should have won by all means there. at least has a flop indicator, that's fair. Oh. I immediately wasted it, cool. I love that. The leg of the item that I got from the checkpoint is what made me waste it. I didn't think they'd give me one, so. There might be something inside that. Space as possible because they didn't know how to stop a level. They didn't know when to stop, basically. I doubt these guys are gonna be real. I'm pretty sure you just go in here and you win. Yeah, it was door. Oh! 
I know where the end is at. Oh, I'm gonna die now because, yeah, I have to die. I know where the end is at. And it's gonna get a boo if it's what I think it is. Oh, okay, you're just gonna kill the player there. <laughs> That's amazing. Straight up killed the player at the checkpoint. Or was found first there. I mean, I guess the title doesn't lie. There's chaos in the castle. They aren't wrong. But I know where the ending is at, and I hate it. It's either in here, there's a door, or it's in the Chrono Creeper pipe. One of those two. It's, there's no other answer. Like it's just like no. Wow. It really is the Piranha Creeper pipe. That's dumb. It should not have been an option. The question is, which pipe is it, though? Is this one at the start here? Or is it this one down here? Because we're gonna find out. Is it this one? It is this one. This level gets a boo now. Yeah, I felt like a troll in the end, but I don't know. Really hard to say, but that's not a good level. Just too long. Doesn't need a, you know, a stupid dev ending, really. Alright, what do we got? A key. This only includes keys from enemies, and keys that are placed on the screen. This does not include red, red coins, basically. Versus one way, any kind of one way. This is a very interesting prediction. Yeah. So if I get a uh, a key through the red co uh, the pink coin, sorry, but I call them red coins. So if I get a, a key through that, it doesn't count. I love how this level has red coins, anyways, and it has one ways on it, but it doesn't count for the prediction. And I feel like it's a long level. It is a long level. Wait, what's the level title? We just love being mean? Aww, oh, why? Come on. <laughs> All of these levels suck today. Well, except for one. We had one that wasn't worth the human like, so never mind. got that one up. Maybe I should have, but I don't know. Oh, it apparently is a red one. It does include curse keys, this is true. The only key that doesn't count in that is the red coins, apparently, according to what Zero set up. Which is fine, I'm cool with that. I think technically Getting coins to turn into a key isn't really a key, it's just a combination of F like they're like key fragments basically. And I can see why that would be a different prediction entirely. Bosh rushes are mean, yeah. Clearly Astro, that's why you would tell me that. Can I get into that pipe? Maybe. Can. Okay, so there's a bonus. Interesting. Where do I find said bonus? Did I come out of? I only want to waste this red flower, fire flower. All right, yeah, you know what? I would like the one up because this level's gonna be really long. Let's just get the one up. I can always come back and get the one up every time I die too, so it's not the biggest deal, you know. It's almost like I'm fighting an extra boss just to get a one up now, because I didn't get the one up earlier. Yeah, boss rushes tend to be very boring, I agree. But this one seems okay. So I would put Windy here. 
instead of Morton. Morty's room was Wendy's room. I think what they did is they mixed up the rooms the Kooplings are supposed to be in or something like that. I don't know. That's what it feels like. Way. Oh, they have one ways on the way in. I can't cheese it. Man, every time I think there's cheese, there's not. But also speaking of one ways, man, imagine that the prediction was for this level. One ways with a one. They give extra fire flowers too, and they are limited, so it's not really all that free. There's a one-way and key on the same tile. Hmm. I usually go left to right, but if they're on the vertical tile, I would say if they're on the same exact tile, if the one-way and the key are touching each other, I would say that one doesn't count. But on a vertical scale, I would say down and up. Left to right, down and up is the rule. This is what I usually go by. But if the one-way is touching the key, I think it's a veto. I think it just gets a reset. It would be pretty funny. You, I've seen plenty of keys on one ways, so it wouldn't be the first time, that's for sure. Please, okay. That was probably the hardest room, I guess, with the Mecha Koopas, but it still was kind of boring. All right, just don't screw me over, yeah. I don't know where that bonus was, but I definitely missed it. Might be here. Oh, it is a checkpoint. Dang it. What did I just hit? Is it a... Why not? Oh, I'm gonna take, take damage for free because of that. Nice. It's always the on-off room being Lemmy's room. In a expert style, but actually super expert next level. I would say this fight is probably more on the super expert side. If they had conveyors going back and forth randomly, but because they're all going one way, it's still expert. Where is that bonus pipe? I missed it somewhere. They give a lot of one ups. That's really nice of them. Oh, this is of course, it's a big fight. And of course, he's above the world where he probably thinks he's at. Making damage from slope jumps thing. Thanks. Should be fine here. Alright, we should be fine up here as long as the fire bar doesn't get us. The last fight wasn't too bad, unless there's a Bowser fight, we'll see. There's still more? It's an auto scroll section with Bowser probably, and Bowser's right here, it's gonna Is this just Bowser Jr.? Because if so, that's cute. I like that. I don't know how you're supposed to get to that bonus fight, but it must have been hidden. Yeah, that, that red coin key is not a key, obviously, yeah. Uh, I'll leave it as an, a neutral because they gave one-ups. Otherwise, I probably would have booted because it just was a boring Let's boss foot rush. All right, this level counts for the prediction. Key versus one way, and it can't be a red coin key. Looks like a job for you. Do I like Sonic's? L Luna, I swear to God, you're going to keep getting the same answer. Yes, I do. Okay. I should mention that he's from... Oh, there's a one-way right here. Never mind. Doesn't matter. What? What? Okay. That's a level so far. And there's a key in the same level, but remember, we saw the one-way first. Uh... 
when I'm turning left, when I'm going to the left, the, the left and right goes backwards, so it's right to left on that, and that would be one way. But if I was going to the right, it would be left to right, yes. But otherwise, it wouldn't seem fair if I'm going in a different direction, and it would be left to right still. So whenever Luigi comes in contact first, for the most part, I didn't know if the points were Podibu markings or not. I wasn't sure. Well, that seems like fun. Very original, you know. Hey, look at Cannon. Yeah, but anyways, one way wins, even though he was right next to that boom boom. It was on the boom boom, but we saw it the one way first. The key was inside the boom boom, therefore we didn't have the we didn't see the key first anyways. But if it was right to left there, and if there was a key on the right side of that one way, then the key would win anyway. What did this level turn into? It's such a chaotic piece of crap, you know. Really? Goomba boss? Just in case there's more than one. I, why would I ever... Well, I do want the coins, but... Alright, let's just trust the level and see what happens. I just want the coins. That's the only reason why I followed the level design. Did you get me a 1-up? No, not really. But you can easily cheese that section by just not running. Or you could just do this, you know. Yeah, I just can't skip, basically. One way we saw first, that is the one I want. 